Happy Friday, Gladiators. I'm John Christofferson. And I'm Abby Lovecki. This is your KWHS News. Sophomores, juniors, and seniors, mark your calendars. If you fancy yourself majoring in dance, music, liberal arts, photography, or theater, you should attend the Performing Arts Fair in Denver on Sunday, October 30th. The fair will feature colleges specializing in performing arts. Go to this link to register. The fair will be from 1 to 3 p.m. at Infinity Park events. Juniors and seniors, college reps have started their visits with us. September 13th, CSU Pueblo. September 14th, CU Boulder. September 21st, UCCS. Metro State University will be here on September 22nd. Colorado College will visit us on September 27th. And to round up the month, George Mason University visits on September 28th. For those of you planning ahead, Grand Canyon will be here on October 6th, Western State University October 11th, Fort Hayes University October 12th, in November UNC Greeley will stop by November 1st, Denver University will be here on the 8th, and Lamar Community College will stop by on November 10th, and ending the month of November, CSU Fort Collins, November 17th. Be sure to go to the Counseling Center to sign up for a pass. Also, seniors, be sure to check out the link on the WH Counseling Center for scholarship ideas. This list is also updated regularly. Hey, Miss Betsy, what's for lunch? Hi, this is Miss Betsy here, just letting you know what's today's lunch. We're having roasted chicken and strawberries. I hope you come down and join us. Thanks, and have a great day. Bye. Remember that the deadline to submit the FAFSA is March 31st for the 2016-2017 school year. This is required for grants, scholarships, and other forms of financial aid. Hey seniors, the first senior class meeting of the year will be held on Thursday, September 15th during advisory in the auditorium. There will be lots of information regarding graduation. If you cannot make the meeting, see Ms. Jones in the Counseling Center. Speaking of graduation, Herf Jones will be in the Lower Commons during lunch on Thursday, September 22nd to help seniors place cap, gown, and graduation announcement orders. Place your orders before winter break before prices go up. Whitefield High School announcements are more limited in January. Go to this link after September 22nd to place your orders. If you have any questions, contact Herf Jones at this number. In case you missed the Red Cross meeting from yesterday, stop by Ms. Ford's room 122 for more information. Interested in science? Come join Science Club and, and find out about all the events you can participate in. Meetings are every Monday at lunch in room 121 with Mrs. Carmody. Now here's Elijah with your sports update. Good morning, lads. I'm Elijah Clark and this is your Gladiator Sports Update. The next fall baseball workout is today at 4 on Big Blue. The football team plays tomorrow against Mitchell at Gary Berry Stadium. Kickoff is at 6. Volleyball played yesterday against Sand Creek. The Lady Glads stung the Scorpions on their home court. Before last night's game, we caught up with senior volleyball player Dari Westberg to see how their season was going. The season's been pretty good. We've been able to do pretty good with our game. We've won at least one of the games out of the three games that we've played totally. The outlook in the season, I believe we can do a really great job. I believe we have a chance to win league due to the skills and skill set each player has. The improvements that need to be made is communication and that we just need to work on certain skills in the front row and just the teamwork in general just needs a little bit work. We all have certain strengths and weaknesses um, and it just helps build out the team. Interested in ultimate frisbee? See Mr. Nell in room 116 or Mr. Wallace in room 4. Softball played TCA yesterday. The sticks were on fire against the Titans and the Lady Glads ran away with the victory. The fastest team has a meet tomorrow at the St. Vrain Invitational. That's your sports update and I'm Elijah Clark. Back to you John and Abby. Thanks Elijah. Are you interested in building robots? The first meeting for robotics will be today at lunch with Mr. White in room 2. There will be a Cyber Patriot informational meeting today at lunch with Mr. Nell in room 116. Hey John, homecoming is right around the corner. Are you ready? Sure am, Abby. I have my plans made and my outside guest form is ready to be turned in by Friday the 16th. All I need are the tickets. Well John, the tickets will be on sale soon. Also, ladies, if you would like a free homecoming dress, then Becca's Closet is for you. See Mrs. Molina in room 111 or Mrs. HK in the library now seen. until the 23rd to make a dress appointment. There are over 100 dress styles and sizes to choose from. The best part of Becca's Closet is the dress is yours to keep. If you still haven't gotten your ID card, they are available in the business office for $3. Remember, you must have your student ID to attend school activities. If you are here for school activities, remember to return the after school activity form to get the sticker. You can get those stickers in the main and business offices. Congratulations to the new freshman council officers. Your president is Ryan Daniel, Vice President Allison Hopper, 
Your secretary is Jackie Machado. Your treasurer is Nicholas Pina. And your secretaries of morale are Ryan Daniel and Aaron Pedarino. That's it for today, Glads. I'm John Christofferson. And I'm Abby Lorbecki. Have a great weekend, Glads. Thank God it's... Bye.